Now to a story you'll see only here on Fox 5. A Barrow County inmate is speaking out after he ate food tainted with pepper spray and the GBI blames one of the jailers. The GBI has charged that detention officer who's been fired by the sheriff with cruelty to inmates and violating their oath of office. As Fox 5's Angelique Proctor tells us, the inmate has hired an attorney and is fighting back. The inmate says he and five other prisoners immediately got sick and had to get medical attention from the jail. Excruciating pain is like somebody, it's even hard to explain. Like, I don't even wish this experience my worst enemy. Inmate Brantavia Sims says ingesting pepper spray during his jailhouse breakfast last month was a horrific experience. The 20-year-old says he is flabbergasted that veteran jailer Lolita Leitner has been arrested by the GBI for the stunt. Barrow County jail officials would not allow us to talk to Sims behind bars, but he talked to his attorney, Jackie, the fly lawyer Patterson, who recorded the conversation. Coughing on blood, I couldn't breathe, my stomach was hurting, they had to put on some medicine called Mayloff. That's not our job to delve out punishment, uh, and this was certainly not justified. Barrow County Sheriff Judd Smith condemns the alleged act and was not sure of the motive. But murder suspect Sims claims the fired officer gave him and five other inmates a subliminal warning the day before. What she was mad about, it was nothing physically toward her. Like, she said she smells smoke in our dorm. Somehow we should have did that on somebody else's shift. Patterson says he and Sims will sue Barrow County over the alleged food tampering. We do plan to sue this county. No question that we're going to send out an antelitum notice. We're asking for $2 million. And if they don't pay this within the 30 days as required by law, we're going to put extra zeros on it and we're going to file a lawsuit for $20 million. I asked Attorney Patterson how he could justify $20 million for this incident. He then told me you can't put a price on pain. In DeKalb County, Angelique Proctor, Fox 5 News.